The Chase host Bradley Walsh is a household name thanks to the numerous shows he's on. Thanks to this, the TV favorite, 63, reportedly has a whopping net worth. And, according to reports, his house is rather lavish. Brad reportedly lives in Essex with his wife, Donna, and has given fans a glimpse into his home on a few occasions. The Chase host Bradley Walsh's home according to reports, Bradley's home is worth £2. 5 meters. It comes complete with an outdoor pool, sauna and a gym. Nice. It's reportedly a barn conversion property in Epping, Essex. It has five bedrooms, apparently. We know Brad's home has a pretty relatable shed as he appeared on this morning live from it during the COVID-19 lockdown. During the appearance, Brad's shed could be seen with many items in it including Christmas decorations, a drum kit and other random clutter. Meanwhile, in 2020, Bradley also showed a glimpse of inside his home during the lockdown. He appeared via video link on this morning again to mark his 60th birthday. As Bradley sat in front of the camera, behind him was some of the house's decor. The room in question had white walls, wooden doors and a matching wooden shelf. Above the shelf appeared to be framed photos and a few small items on top of the shelf. In a video shared to his Instagram in 2020, Bradley appeared to film from his kitchen as he told fans about his show Breaking Dad being shortlisted for a TV Choice Award at the time. Bradley was seen sitting on a grey sofa and in the background showed stools, white walls and a glass railing. Last July, meanwhile, Bradley appeared to share a video from his office. He was issuing fans a message about scammers on Instagram, and revealed he was speaking from, my office. Although he didn't confirm the office was his house, the same color theme was seen with white walls and wooden doors. A row of different hats also hung behind Bradley. What did Brad say about his childhood? Bradley previously opened up about where he lived when he was a child. Speaking to The Telegraph in 2012, Brad said, I was born in Watford, and grew up in a council house. My mother was a single parent, who had to struggle hard to make ends meet. At one point she was holding down three different jobs. It was a happy childhood, but we certainly didn't have a great deal of money.